Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Kyle, this is Kyle Plays Games. This is Construction Simulator, and yes, I know it's been pretty frequent on this uh, channel, but you know what? I've been enjoying it. You guys have been enjoying the uh, videos, so definitely looking forward to bringing more content of this one. Just got done with the road construction project in the uh, tourism area, and uh, now I want to actually build something. So, uh, uh, like a building. So uh, we got a resort here that's available. Let's take a look at the jobs anyway. I'm not gonna. I don't want to zoom in. Uh, let's see what the contracts. And uh, looking forward to putting that together pretty soon. Um, uh, there's another road project we could really go crazy on it, or uh, we could just do the tourist area here. Let's go ahead and do that one. Let's go ahead and put the resort in there. Bit of a longer one, but I'm uh, definitely going to enjoy doing this one. Oh, we have a different thing here. This is going to be good. All right, let's, let's accept this contract. Estimated earnings a little over a million dollars. That is going to be awesome to get. All right, so first thing first is we're going to have to get a motor grader pretty much. Wow, okay. First time I've ever had to use this. So how about, can I fast travel down here? Actually, what's the point of fast traveling until I... Uh, just, let's just get the uh, go to the vehicle dealer first. Let's enter in here, and we need something. Okay, there's a, there's one motor grader there. Wow, that is interesting. How that one is here. Is there anything else I can do? Tab one A. Okay, this might be helpful. It jumped completely on me. I did not mean for it to do that. I'm going to use this one. Let's go ahead and rent it. Because actually, I could just purchase it. Yeah, just purchase it. Just buy it. Okay. All right. One machine in each class in the USA. Oh, now you're just doing an achievement with that one. All right. Well, let's go ahead and head over to the to the motor grader. Let's enter it, and then we'll fast travel. I have no idea how to use this thing, by the way. So this will be fun. All right, where do I go? Oh, it works like this. Oh, okay, all right. Um, all right. So we have a lower lift, double front blade. Ooh. Oh, I guess I'm just supposed to rip this up. I am really going fast here. This is... I'm just turboing around here. Look at this. Look at the turn radius on this. I'm having some fun here. Let's zip around and go whatever we want to do here. Right. Got to rip up this ground somehow. Oh, man. Yeah, totally having a whole lot of fun. To, yeah, we're just going to zigzag around here. Oh, man. I'm going to make you guys so sick watching this video. I'm making myself dizzy right now. Man, this really speeds along. Holy crap. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Alright, that's gotta be a pit area or something there. Take care of this spot here. Definitely damaged something. Gonna speed along and not get hit by that same area. We're at 67. Okay, it's probably this spot here. The hello. This this something stuck there. Tuple piece there. Tuple section here too. 80%, gotta figure out where the other area is that I need to rip up. Come on now, come on. Oh, 
like bouncing around the 85 area. Seven now, eighty-eight, eighty-seven. Somehow we're going, we're uh, decreasing in progress. Didn't know that was even possible. Hit the wrong button there. Sorry about that. Trying to figure out where the spot is that I need to dig up. Just gonna do some burnouts and we're gonna do some donuts here. Seems like I might have, seems like I've digging up dug up enough spot, you think? Really don't know what else of an area I need to hit. Oh my goodness, getting so dizzy. Maybe it is like that solid spot here. Now still 95, 96. 95 again, and we are really just bouncing along. I have no idea where this other part is. Wow, this is... <laughs> this is tedious! And I have no idea if I'm doing it right or not. Apparently I'm not doing it right. The sun's starting to set. It's going to be harder for me in order to see everything. We're at 99. Come on. Just give me 100. Just give me 100 so I can move on. How am I regressing in the progress? Maybe if I bring the front plate up, will that help me? It will! Who knew? Okay, we're gonna reset. Um, I don't know if I need this anymore. I'm gonna keep this in the construction site though. This thing tells me I might need it. All right, I need to remove soil. Um, I don't think we're gonna do this part yeah, that's gonna take a lot of, uh, yeah, we need a wheel. Okay, remove, uh, okay, yeah, we're gonna skip this guy. It says soil removal and then the back lifting. Okay, so what I want me to do is remove, I'm assuming we're moving this stuff and then also fill the area with soil and I, I'm, I'm not, we're not gonna mess with it. We're gonna skip ahead from this. We're gonna skip this task. Yep, because, all right, what's, what? Where that one is supposed to be. It's supposed to be something. It might have been that one, but we're going to skip the fill area with soil part two. Okay. Got to clear the construction site. I'm going to, I'm just going to store you. Okay. Company vehicle fleet. 
And motor grader, let's just store you away. I need to get off the uh, construction site. Okay, we're good. Now I have to deliver construction materials. Okay, so we have that one done. Yeah, I knew it was gonna be like the area here that it was gonna be like, okay, you have to remove that um, hill and then fill in this hole here. So next is going to be deliver all the construction materials and we're going, well, we're gonna need that crane. So first things first is we are going to head over to the, not the vehicle dealer, the bulk, the building material dealer. Let's enter into there. I need everything here. So many items. All right. $53,000 and then we're going to deliver to the construction site and it's going to be almost $7,000 but you know what it's it's a uh, purchase well um, expense look at all of that there all right well crane area we need uh, we need the tower cranes let's go ahead and set that up that cost me money just in order to be able to build put that up man don't see have you guys missed this small party or no I've definitely missed the crane. Let's lower this. We need to move all of this stuff here. Look at all these materials. How am I supposed to decipher this? Okay, we have one rebar mess, so that is the big one here. This is legit gonna be like Tetris. All the way out. All right, that's one thing. Cable drum is the next thing. This might be a two-parter for all I know. I mean, like, this is a massive project. All right, where's that cable drum at? Somewhere. Okay, it's right in the middle here. Swing that all the way around. Hopefully not, don't knock anything over. Right, we got that pallet of concrete formwork. We need two of those. Let's swing back around. Nope, not that way. Not that way. This should be one of these. Swing this thing around. Hopefully I'll have some kind of glowing image. There we go. I did pick up the right one. Good enough for me there. Let's grab the other one. I'm trying to just go right down the list here so I'm not like confusing myself on what to pick up. So I don't get lost in all the mess that is everything I got delivered. a few things. It's alright. It's concrete form work. It's not going to move anything. There we go. Alright, and next is wood ceiling elements. Hopefully that is right here, I believe. I'm trying to control... The crane efficiently enough. Drop it down. All right. Do you have one more? I think I think the other one's uh, below an item, so I'm gonna have to move it. Let's right, check out the light. 
Yeah, I gotta move this. Alright. Actually, we have one right here. Now let's go grab this. Come on. Alright, bulk material transport sack. I saw where that one was at. Took out the other light. Might as well make it even. Perfect landing. Ceiling component. I believe that is this here. Yep. Boy, I'm getting good at identifying these things. All right, there goes the other light. We we just we'll just work in the dark. It's fine. Pallet of concrete elements. What is this? And why can't I control this now? Ah, way over here. Okay. There we go. Got all that done. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here for a moment. And spin it around here. Was that a shooting star? That's like a shooting star there. Or was that an airplane? Eh, nope, that's an airplane. That's an airplane. All right, these construction materials first go. The rebar. There's that. Now we got a poor slab foundation. Oh, goody, we're gonna do the concrete. Concrete mixer pump, let's go ahead and take that out. One of the all-time faves. Maybe. I don't know. Let me know in the comments if this is your favorite one, or if this is your one that you loathe the most. Either way, I gotta do it. Alright. All of this area needs to get concreted. Won't be too bad. Let's fill this thing up. Alright, bracket down. Move out this arm. We'll try to extend as far as we can. That's a pretty good extension right there, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. Try to cover as much as we can. Got a big, got a big arm. Let's destroy bandits. Extend more, extend more. I think that's all I can do. I'm probably like vertical at some point. Way back. I got some pretty good coverage on that. All 
Okay, it's empty. Let's fill it back up. Time to turn that back on. Turn it back on. There we go. One thing about this mixer pump is that it's kind of glitchy at that with that situation. Raise it up a bit. Camera angle is really weird right now. Probably get to about 90%, we'll have to end up adjusting this. Oh my goodness, what is going on with this arm? Yeah, about 90%. Alright, let's go ahead and reset. Go to drive mode, let's cover the rest of it, and then we should be able to move on. This little section here, let's go ahead and get pretty close to it. Eh, right about. And when I say close, I mean by, you know, let's go ahead and have like a football field, you know, uh, between myself and the project at hand. Try to raise up the arm a little high. Uh, start off close. Can hardly see what I'm doing, where the camera is, but we covered a corner. There we go. Let's extend this out. This should be enough in order to be able to cover the rest of it. 97, 98, 99, and we're good. Okay. All right. Next is pour the columns and walls. Um, let's go into drive mode. Let's get a little closer to the uh, other corner. We're going to back up. Try here. Bracket. So you literally have to have to pour into each column. Well, that's going to be tedious. I'm just saying. Can I extend all the way? Yes, I can. Perfect aim. Look at that. It's off. Alright, there we go. Luckily enough, I don't waste any while I convert to the next one. Transfer over to the next one. I get this, you know, try to get the transition over here as quickly as possible. Oh, come on. Come on. You're kidding me, right? You're kidding me. Clearly I won't be able to catch the other, the other ones over here. Might be too far of a reach. Yeah, it could be too far for me to reach out. Well, maybe not. Yep, too far. No, I'm not wasting it. This game will not allow you to waste 
materials. I have learned that from panic. Fill it back up. Turn the pouring back on. Fill it right up. There we go. That's good. So we need to fill these up. And it turned off the pouring. Why? Why would you turn that off? So to take care of the columns. That's still a part of my job description here. There we go. Line up, line up. All right, now I gotta reset. Go to drive mode, I gotta take care of the other two. We'll drive right into the area. I don't think I can bracket down here. I don't think I can. It'd be kind of stupid to do that anyway. All right, that should be good. Brace down here. Like so, there we go. And we're at 100, we're good. All right, next is going to be the prefabricated wall element. Um, I'm gonna go into drive mode. I'm gonna keep this here, but I'm going to get a little bit out of the way. So then it tells me I'm still gonna be pouring walls. I might be, I don't know. All right, we need to deliver things too. So, all right, so next up is going to, I have to go to the vehicle dealer. And I need, I'm gonna need one of these multi-trailers. So let's just go ahead and get the cargo trailer. That's, that's gonna be good enough for that. Wait. Yeah, this will be fine. Ah, uh, could just purchase it. I should just purchase it. Let's just go ahead and purchase. Okay, we got that. And also need the truck. The tractor, there it is. Tractor crane, should I get that one? No, I'm just, just go to get the tractor. I already got a crane, so there's no point to me. Well, it might be helpful. No, you know what, no, no. Let's get the tractor. Let's go ahead and purchase this also. All right. All right, let's enter the tractor. Then we'll attach it. Where do you guys put this trailer at? On the other side of here. Feels like nothing's loaded up. Feels like I'm going through something that should, that should be here. This game hasn't needed to load up this side of town here in a while. Okay, that's attached. Let's head over to the prefabricated wall factory. I don't like to drive to places anymore. I just spend the money just in order to get there, in order to get there quicker. Uh, next is going to be construction stage B. Uh, elevator staffs. Okay. I, Okay, I don't know if I need... I don't know if, uh... Okay, let's enter into here. What we have here? Stage B. Okay, we'll purchase this. Load it. Okay. 
have everything there. Fast travel back to the construction site, the work site. Hope I can get 50% done by the time that my time limit is up. This is gonna be a two-parter, my goodness. I, I mean, I knew, was, I knew this is a big job, but wow. Okay, stop staring and laughing at my, at my progress. It's not good for my self-esteem if you keep on pointing and laughing. All right, that's good. Kind of pin myself in here. Let's go ahead and unlock this transport frame. Good there. And the same thing here. Unlock this. Now the other one, the prefabricated wall element concrete, that has already been um, delivered. Auto that has been automatically delivered. So let's install this because the first thing that popped up. Yeah, where is this going? Right here in this little pit area. I don't know if it matters. Doesn't matter. We're just gonna slam it in there and it'll click in. It's okay. It's held together by tacks. It's fine. Alright, drop it down. There we go. I'll have to pour more concrete there, but let's grab these wall elements. Let's see where they go. Alright, that one goes real close. That's nice. Nope, there we go. Didn't click on the button too quick. And with a good stop, I got that one. I got ya. This thing goes all the way out here. Way out here. Glad I paid, bought the money for... Yeah, yeah bought the money. Yeah, I'm glad I spent the money to buy uh, all these materials, all this, all this equipment now. No longer paying rental costs. Come on. What do we got here? This one is here, and hopefully it won't matter that it's backwards. There we go, alright, we're fine. Halfway through, almost halfway through. I'm kind of thinking ahead. ahead. Alright, this is a solid wall. I think I saw this one over here, yep. Well, through the process of elimination, Kyle, you would know where these pieces would go. I love how it just like floats in, in, in air, like nothing's holding it together. Alright, that was one frame down. Need to get over here, get the other other four. Alright, settle down. Settle down. Alright, got one. Doesn't really matter where it goes, just gotta drop it in. Preferably not against the concrete pillar. Just testing the integrity of the building. I mean, no storms show up in this uh, in this city anyway, but you know what? You still gotta test it. Drag it. There we go. Come on, position. Position. There we go. Alright, we got the third uh, bay doorway or window, whatever this is. There we go. And one last one. Come on, position. Got it. There we go. All the other stuff has been automatically applied. 
Oh, they had the ceiling elements. All right. It was loading up the next thing to do. I was kind of wondering why it wasn't po nothing was popping up. Got six of them. At least we don't have to spend too much time on this part. small piece. Don't know where this one goes. Oh, it's right here. That's pretty simple. There we go. It's barely got that in the area. All right, bigger pieces will go just on the other side. Good enough. one last one and then it'll probably fabricate the rest of the ceiling ceiling tiles up or the ceiling timbers that's what the proper name is all right all right come on don't lose it don't lose it now don't lose it there we go all right Oh, I advanced in player level and have received a new skill point. That's great to know. All right, well, we might as well stay in the crank. we got to deliver two wood ceiling elements and two ceiling components. And all right, so... I, um... I have to move these. I think I have to move these out first. Putting that there. Uh, I don't think it's it. Was if it's a two-parter. No, nope, it's not that. Um, is it this? Is it? Yep. Come on. Work around. Will one of these be glowing? Oh yeah. All right. Well, I guessed right the second time. Swing it back around, get that other ceiling component. Way over here, way out there. These are ones I believe that will need to be um, concreted too. This is why I didn't put away the uh, cement truck. All right, wood ceiling elements. These are square ones, so these would be this one right here in the corner. Swung too far. And one more. That one is buried, so I gotta move the pipe. You have to lay down your pipe somewhere else here. Come on, get back. Yeah, it's good. All right, now we got a poor walls. Let's go ahead and raise this up a little bit, and let's get back to our cement truck. I believe it's on this side. Am I right? Yes, it is. All right, where are the walls that I need to cement? Hard to see, hard to tell where I'm supposed to be driving to. Ah, up here, okay. 
Um, alright, first of all, let me go ahead and return this. I'm in my own way. this out. I'm probably going to need to pick up more prefabricated walls, so I'm just going to put, put this in this just off to the side, like so. Get back in our truck. I could just fast track it as I go right into the truck, but I decided just to actually get fitness in and run to it. Alright. Should have enough arm length here, I should, to be able to uh, just pour these quick wall, this quick wall, this is going to be quick. Let's extend. Alright, there we go. How are you empty? You're not empty. Okay, I, I don't know what how it's empty because it's it, like it's practically full and the suit's not even backwards or anything. I just wanted me to do this again. That's all I did. It was, it was so smooth it wanted me to do this again. You know, for an instant replay. this up. There we go. Alright. Go back into drive mode. I'm going to move this out of the way for a little bit. Do some expert backing up. Oh yeah, that's expert level right there. All right, prefabricated wall up in Mount Timber is first, but I have to place the right, let's place the elevator shafts because they got delivered to me immediately. Where are they at? Okay, here we go. It's a giant mess of everything. I swear. You put the elevator shafts in. Camera angle is really weird. Oh, sneak in there, sneak in there. There we go. Get the other one in. Come on, come on, you can do it. Just glide in. There we go, perfect. All right, uh, next is going to be, we do have the ceiling elements concrete. Let's go ahead and grab this because we're already in the crane. Going a little backwards on the uh, stuff here, but it's cool, it's fine. Six of these to put on. the integrity of all the pillars. Hello! Camera went all wonky on me. Alright, bigger slabs of uh, 
concrete elements now. You can obviously tell where the step goes. Drop it down here. Two more to go, and then we'll get the prefabricated wall element. And unfortunately, based on the time frame I have right now, I think. Oh, hello, where, where are we going? Where are we going here? Camera, camera decided to change. <laughs> it's decided to change the entire sense of direction. There we go, okay, all right. Almost lost it there, but we recovered. We're fine. Let's get this last ceiling element. Somehow we'll position this, this crane again into the right spot. Drag it down, it's fine. Come on. There we go. Alright, and next is going to be is the prefabricated wall timber. So we'll get out of here for a little bit. Where's my truck at? Now we gotta travel back to the wall factory and uh, pick up the next piece of uh, materials. We'll fast travel because I'm not driving all the way over here. It's asking a lot. Alright, pull into one of the loading bays. Slam on those brakes, it's fine, they're mine now. Alright, enter into here, and we have this one. Okay, construction C, purchase that. And let's load them up. All right, no more prefabricated wall elements. Deliver these, install them, and uh, this might be the end of the video then with uh, installing these. Why, why, why is the camera positioning like that? There's no point in doing that. Okay, you guys, you two need to find a job because uh, this gawking at this is not helping you guys out. Okay, hopefully that's uh, a good enough distance for it. Okay, let's unlock this. Let's unlock this one too. All right, get to the crane. I cannot believe we're only 30% done. It's insane. I'll take whatever one. And where's this going right here? Perfect. Swing this crane around, grab the next one. Where's this one going to? There, all right, just gonna float there for a little bit until it gets secure. Next up is here, so I'm assuming this goes, if I can just get the crane to work with me. Here, cool. Camera went all a little wonky there. All right, that's halfway done. Need the smaller ones. Where does this go? Where does this go? There we go, okay, there we go. Another small little wall. There we 
we go, perfect. Just testing the structural integrity by slam it, smacking it up against the uh, other walls. Gives it a nice distressed look. Ah, oh, almost had it on the swing in. Almost had the timing right. Really? There we go. And last one. There we go. Perfect. All right, need to concrete the ceiling. I got a little bit of time here, uh, but we do have to do the ceiling element, the timber. Let's go ahead and do that since I'm in the crane already. It's only four pieces too. I'm really just trying to get as close as I can to 50% done, but it's not gonna happen in this one. I just know it. This is a large area of land too. I was really trying to position that one and it wasn't working for me. I right, just flip it, it's fine. We'll get it in the right spot, perfect. That piece will just be upside down a little bit. It's, it's, it's fine, it's totally fine. No one's gonna notice it. We'll just put a painting on the side of the wall there and nobody, on the side of the wall there and nobody will notice the uh, ceilings upside down. Let's have a light fixture that's pointing out. It'd be a skylight. And one more here. Come on, come on, position. Come on. And down we go. There we go. All right, we do need to concrete the ceiling, so I'll move this somewhere. I'm still gonna need to use it for other pieces, so right about here, maybe? Yeah, that's good. All right, let's get this done real quick, really fast. Rack it down here, and please, please fill out quick. All right, start pouring. Really trying to do it as fast as possible. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, we're empty. Okay, fill that back up. Turn our suit back on. Let's go maybe reposition and do the rest of it. I just know it. Cover a little bit of ground there, but not enough. Okay, we're going to reset and we have to move around. I can't reach the rest. this now. Seventy percent. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to reach this part. I have to get really close to it. lucky here. You're kidding me. You are kidding me. go now I got to reach I literally had to fill it up for okay there we go all right reset all right well and guess what I've reached my time limit on this one here I just looked at the ticker it reached an hour give or take a few minutes for the video so with that being said this will be a two-parter hopefully it's just a two-parter but this is a huge construction project but uh, looking forward to jump back into it for a, for a part two um, to try to finish it up here. 
But thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this part of this construction project, and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to leave a like on the video. It really helps me out. What also helps me out is by sharing the video and also subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Remember, 400 subs, and I will get some kind of DLC pack for this game. Not sure what it'll be because I don't know what's offered, but I uh, felt like doing that for the uh, channel goal. If I'm already surpassed 400 subscribers by the time you either discover this channel or uh, decide to uh, subscribe, be sure to anyway. I'm certain doing something with the subscriber count at any given moment, so your uh, support really does help reach any kind of goal that uh, I have set forth. Leave a comment too. Let me know what you think about the video in the comments down below. And if you'd like to watch these videos happen live, link is in the description down below for my Twitch channel. And be sure to follow on Twitch so you don't miss out the next time that I go live. Thank you so much for watching part one of this uh, construction project, and I hope to see you for part two in the next video.